So we've got this old Gale 420 uh, hay rake here. And we use the merger for all of our silage. So this one just gets used for some oats and a little bit of dry hay. But what's going on is these holes are all slopped out from being old and well used. So what happens is the rake just kind of flops around and doesn't do a good job raking hay. So we're going to take it apart here and we're going to see if we can fix some of these holes. So anyway, we're going to try to get her put together, fixed up so we can use it to make some hay tomorrow. We got some molds down. So we can definitely see what our problem is here. Let me get out of the shadow. So the pin's in here, and this is, she broke. This is supposed to be welded in there nice and solid, but you can see that she's just shot. So we're gonna try to build it up with some weld. By we, I mean me, because that's all there is around here. I'm gonna uh, try to weld it and fill in fill in all those slots so it's not flopping around so bad got it out we got the pipe back in there you can see it was welded in once and all slopped out we got we got it all ground down so we can weld on it and we're gonna i'm gonna weld it back together here This is where we're at so far. I got it, <clears throat> excuse me, I got it welded around till there was too big of a gap. So then I got a bolt here, cut it so that it fits in there, so that it fits in there properly. And now I'm gonna weld that into place. That way it can fill in the gap and hold everything together and grind it down. So you can see I welded a bolt in there. It's all gobby, but it's to build that area back up so that it holds the pin. You can see I left the pin in there just so I don't weld it tight. So I have plenty of gap there. So we'll flip the other side over and do the other side. So I've got it upside down here. I welded on the side just a little bit. I had the pin in there so we don't lose the hole, but you can see I still have this gap here to fill in. So I got a bolt and I'm just gonna set it in here and I'm just gonna weld in one pass and then weld in another pass with it. So I have something to fill in that big hole with. So that's what the final product looks like. Gobby, nasty, but it should be better than it was. We're gonna put the, put the wing back on and see if everything lines up. I got her all back together. We're all hooked up, so we're gonna head on out and go rake some hay. And hopefully she holds together a little bit longer here. You wouldn't know anything's different other than there's a little bit of a grind mark there. It's all buried underneath that little contraption there. Got her greased up. Of course, the places that take grease aren't the places that needed grease. I think there's no grease zerks on these pins here that are all shot and wore out on the cylinders where it rides and jiggles around. But there are there, which is probably a place that would never wear out really. But anyway, we got her all back together and we're gonna go rake some hay. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button below. And if you want to see more videos like this come up in your feed, please subscribe to our channel. And uh, if you want to find out when our next video comes out every week, hit that notification bell below and uh, that'll send you a notification when our next video comes out, which we try to send them out every week. Thanks a lot for learning more about our farm and we sure appreciate it.